Okay, in this video we're going to look at how to convert from decimals to fractions. Now whenever you convert from decimals to fractions, I personally think the easiest way is just to consider um, place value and consider how a number is made up. So, you'll remember that you've got units, tens, hundreds, thousands and so on. Whenever you go to the side, remember you've got units, then you've got tenths, okay? So it's tenths, okay? And then you've got unit tenths, hundredths, so these ones here are called hundredths, okay, if you had another decimal place they would be called thousandths and so on, okay, so if you wanted to write 0 0.7 as a fraction, okay, because it's 7 tenths, you write it as 7 tenths, like so. So because they're in the temps column and you've got seven of them, you're at seven temps. You try to cancel this down if possible. Um, I've chosen one that can't be chosen, uh, simplified. Okay, let's have a look at this one. 0 0.13. So you've got units, temps, hundredths. So you've got 13 hundredths. So 13 hundredths, you'd write it as 13 hundredths. Like so. Again, you would try to cancel it down if possible. Let's look at a couple of more examples. Okay, so we're going to do four more examples. We're going to convert 0 0.8, 0 0.14, 0 0.5, and 0 0.123 as, uh, from decimals to fractions. So 0 0.8, that's units, temps. So you've got units, temps. You've got 8 temps, so it's going to be 8 over 10. Now this can be simplified. 8 and 10 are both divisible by 2, so cancel it down to 4 fifths. So your answer is 4 fifths. Next one. You've got no units, one tenth, and four hundredths. So that's fourteen hundredths. So fourteen hundredths. Uh, again, because you, uh, this can be cancelled down, you can both of them are divisible by two. So you get seven over fifty, and these are have got no common factors, so you can't divide those by anything. Okay, the next one. Now, the next one, certain fraction or certain decimals, fractions, and percentages. You should just know what they are. This is a half, 0 0.5 is a half, and you should know that, okay? So 0 0.5 is just a half. If you wanted to, you could go, you know, say it's 5 tenths, and then cancel down, divide it by 5 to get 1 over 2. Uh, but I personally think you should just know 0 0.5 is a half. Likewise, 0 0.25 being a quarter. I and mean, if you're really good at maths, 0 0.125 being an eighth, and so on. Um, yeah. Okay, the next one. You've got units, tenths, hundredths, thousandths. You've got 123 thousandths, so 123 over 1,000. And if this is possible, to cancel it down. Um, I don't think this one is, so that's my answer.